with the 85th pick, the Green Bay Packers select Amari Rogers. Now I'm here to help the team win. You know, I'm here to help the team get over that hump and get a Super Bowl. To the end zone, touchdown, you know, I've won at the highest level of my life at every point. I don't plan on stopping now. Amari Rogers across the 35. Packers is the perfect situation, the perfect organization to go in and do that. So I'm just ready to work. Amari Rogers. Amari, the Packers traded up to get you. I mean, they really wanted Amari Rogers. Isn't that pretty cool? It feels amazing uh, just to know that I'm going into a situation where I know that you know I'm wanted. Uh, it feels great and it's a blessing to know that you know I'm walking into a great team like the Packers, so you know I'm ready to go. Snap to A-Rod. Rushes on. Looking. Close. Middle. Yes. Got his man. Break his He may go all the way. Right on top. To the foul. To the end zone. To the touchdown. Let's see, your dad coaches Randall Cobb at Kentucky. Randall Cobb becomes a mentor for you. The Packers have not had a receiver like Randall Cobb since Randall Cobb, and here you are. Was this meant to be? Was this football destiny? It, it seems like it, doesn't it? <laughs> it kind of feels like it. So, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm blessed to, you know, be able to have a mentor like Randall that's been there that, you know, has experience with the Packers and, you know, he's going to give me great advice. Matt LaFleur and his staff are very creative guys. They have terrific schemes. Are you excited about the possibilities of working in a system like that? Yeah, I'm, I'm very excited. You know, I've heard great things about those guys. You know, I've seen it, of course. You know, Devontae Adams is my favorite receiver. I watch him every single weekend. So, you know, throughout this past couple of seasons, you know, I've been seeing them play almost every week. So I see all the creativity, you know, how they're able to set their players up to make the uh, plays. So, you know, I'm just ready for it. Well, Amari, watching you run routes, I mean, there's kind of a sophistication to it. When I'm watching it, I'm seeing a guy that sometimes changes speed to get open. I'm looking at a guy that goes out there with a plan. Is that the way you approach it? Yes, sir. You got to have a plan. You know, you got to have an A and a B and a C plan. So that's really part of being a receiver, especially as a pro, because, uh, you know, uh, all the DBs are fast. All of them are smart. So, you know, you got to have a, a great plan and be able to study film and, and see what things are going to work versus them. What are you hoping to get done in your first year as a rookie? You know, just find my spot, my niche in the offense, and, you know, just be comfortable. You know, be able to learn a playbook and be able to go out there and play fast and have my teammates trust that I'm going to go out there and do what I need to do to help the team win. Uh, that's really my mindset, and I'm going to do whatever it takes. Oh!